I'm going to show you the easiest gel to use for the trending 3D effect shell nails today. So, quick six second intro, so you can click any button you want to click. I'll get ready and we'll crack on. So, I'm using All Bone Pretty today and I'm using all the colours from, I've got a jelly colour and then the rest are from the Silky White series. So it's just a quick video because I wanted to come on to tell you about uh, Bone Pretty current sale. So I'll have it coming across the screen somewhere down here um, for you to have a look at the uh, discount code to use. I always have a 22% discount, but at the minute you can get 25%. So I'll put that up there. Uh, with the dates and everything on there for you. So I've just got an extremely long stiletto in here. So I'm just rounding off that end a little bit. So... You can buff the surface of your nail tips so that they uh, buff the surface of your nail tips so they'll adhere your gel because gel don't want to stick to a shiny surface. But I'm going to use some primer that I've got uh, and that'll etch into that surface and that will hold the gel nicely. And usually they're air dry. But this one's a 30 second cure. So the first jelly that I'm going to use is this. It's JNO5. I've said it before. It's one of my absolutely favourite jellies. Um, other than the ones from the X-Gel series. Uh, but I need to get myself another one of those. This is a beautiful pink. So base coat done. So I'm going to use this, this JN05. And I'm going to do two coats. So I'm going to paint the French on the end uh, for the shell in CG061. So you could do the full nail, but I'll do it as a shell. So I've got a little bit, a little bit on there. And I only need one coat of that, it don't really matter. It's not like we're keeping it as it is. So 60 seconds on that one. And the other colours I'm going to bring in are these. I've got CGO 78, which is a lovely sort of milk coffee colour. Uh, CGO 70. There's about 130 colours in the um, Silky White series. They might be all on one listing or they might be on two. Because um, I think there's about 100 cream or jelly ones and about 30 glitters. Okay, so now I'm going to put the second coat on very thin of this. So it's going to act a little bit like a blooming gel. And this little fine brush, you can use an ombre brush if you want. I'm just going to use this little fine brush and we need to go up it. And 
bend your hand a little bit. That's it. And now this beige or coffee colour. Much of that bit, sweeten that up. There we go. I think I need a bit more of that pink back. And there, that's it. Cure that. So that's cured, but I'm going to do uh, a slightly darker line with this milky coffee and a very, very fine, very fine. Uh, Liner brush. So if you've not got a steady hand, leave that bit out. Don't you think they all look gorgeous together anyway? The pink and the cream in the coffee. They look really nice. Um, right, so what we're going to do now is I'm going to top coat. So this is... Born Pretty's Chrome Mirror Top Coat. So I'll do the whole nail in this. So I got this from Born Pretty. This is just the uh, shimmering chrome. So no particular colour to it. Or you could say white. I'm just putting this chrome all over. Do you know what? I'm just going to try a different one. I got this one as well. Let's, let's see if this one's any different. Goodness me, I tell you what, if you don't want your chrome to come off, Definitely use that chrome top coat because I've just did a right job getting that off there. Um, I've gone through about three three wipes to, to get that off. <laughs> just because I want to try this one instead. Because that one's gone a bit pinky and I don't know if this one will too. Which is me cleaning this one. Well, let's try that. Might be exactly the same. No, this is more white. That's what I want. So that's this one. So either of those or your chrome of choice. So I'm just going to take the edge off that a little bit. Brush it all that away. And top coat again. So I've cleaned away all of the chrome and everything. And now I'm just going to use this, which is nail rhinestone glue. It's comes in a 30 gram pot. 
and it's got quite a small nozzle on the end and I've got a little uh, lamp to freeze it into place. So I'm just going to start there. Let's clean this up. Just going to make sure my nozzle's nice and clean. That's it. In the middle. And I'm lifting and stop. enough for now and then I still have to take her off the stand Hold it upside down if you're worried. Oh, you're in the lamp. That's it. So you can chrome on top of that if you want. Or... Give it just a little wipe. stick a couple of shells on because that's what that's for as well and there we are all done thank you anybody using the discount code i've got it helps us both out and uh, it's 22 percent normally so don't forget the sale this week and uh, it's free shipping day every 10th of the month uh, if you want to take advantage of that and if you do buy anything let me know I always wonder what you've bought and I get a message but don't tell me what you've actually bought so or who it is. So thank you very much for watching everybody. Short and sweet I know today, so I hope you've enjoyed it and I'll see you next time. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you soon. Love ya, bye.